Hey what's up everybody welcome to my channel with a brand new video and today in this video I'm gonna show you the brand new settings of the Nvidia you can use to overclock your GPU safely without damaging your graphics card or invalidating your GPU warranty. Make sure to stick with this video till the end and at the end of the video I'm gonna also show you the results of the overclocking on the FPS in our Fortnite. So make sure to follow this whole guide and without wasting any time let's dive straight into over this video. Gear the Booster is one of the best programs for the optimization of your ping while you play games using your wired or wireless connections. So guys get the paid program free from the link in the description and play your game with lower ping. So guys in the very first step you need to download this Nvidia app on your PC. You can find out the link in the description of my this video. Simply go there and download this Nvidia app on your PC. Once you open up the link that will take you on the official website of the Nvidia. Simply download the beta version of the Nvidia app and install it on your PC. After installation, you need to go for the settings option, go for about tab and make sure to guys check mark onto the early axis for having all the features of the Nvidia app on your PC. Once you turn on this option, simply close out your Nvidia app and reopen it. After that, you will find out here the system tab, go for it. There you will find out this performance tab and now here you will find out auto tuning option. Auto tuner which find the best overclock settings for your GPU and maintain that performance on regular basis. This is also explained by the Nvidia itself this will not damage your GPU or not even invalidate the warranty of your GPU. So guys simply turn on this option and this will do everything for you. It's depend on PC to PC this will take around 5 to 10 minutes to find the best overclock settings for your GPU. After that here you will find out all the stats of your GPU. Once you follow the settings make sure you guys go for this fan speed and set it on automatic for guys lowering the temperature of your GPU. Because if you have lower temperature that means you are getting the more performance out of your GPU. Once you're done now you need to go for this graphics tab go for global settings and there you will find out all the important settings of the Nvidia. So in the very first step there you will find out RTX dynamic vibrance turn off the settings cuda gpu set it on your nvidia gpu whatever you're using if you are using the multiple gpus on your pc so go for this option and select all these gpu on your pc after that hit apply and close out this window then here we go dsr factor this is the outdated option so guys make sure to turn off the settings image scaling turn off this option low latency mode go for this drop down and set it on on or ultra mode i'm using the ultra for my pc now go for max frame rate turn it off unity technology set it on g-sync compatible power management mode set it on prep for maximum performance then shadow crashes set it on 100 gb vertical sync turn off the settings and virtual reality variable super sampling also turn off the settings after that hit apply and close out your nvidia app now in the next step we are going to disable the power throttling that is also limiting the performance of our gpu so for the press windows are together from your keyboard type your gp edit dot msc and press enter now go for computer configuration administrative template windows component now you need to go system folder now scroll down and find out here power management folder inside you will find out this power throttling settings inside this folder you will find a turn off power throttling simply double tap here and now from here you need to enable the setting for turning off the power throttling on your pc now hit apply click ok and close out this window now you need to one time reach your pc there for all the changes take effect after that launch your fortnite and guys here is the performance of the overclock and stock settings of the nvidia into this bar i have recorded all this stat using the cap frame x application and guys here you can check out here i'm getting like 235.2 fps using the overclock settings of the nvidia and on the stock settings i'm getting like 228 fps this is around 7 fps difference but guys this will also reduce the stutters and also make your fortnite way more smoother than before if you use the overclock settings on your pc i hope so guys you love this video please make sure to drop a like on this video subscribe to my channel and see you again in the next video